Oh! Look at the fun you can have when you ignore gridlock alert days. Look at this. Look at this. And you get a gridlock alert day! And you get a gridlock alert day! And you get a gridlock alert day! Everybody! Can I get a hell yeah for congestion pricing? Hell yeah! So I think it was Thomas Jefferson when he was writing the Declaration of Independence. He wrote, said something about gridlock alert days are fruitless or something about inalienable rights. I don't know. Something like that. He was smarter than a sock puppet, though. Hey, these people want to talk to me. Hello. Who are you people? Hi. How do you guys feel about gridlock alert days? Do you think they're stupid? Yeah. Because they don't do anything, right? Yeah. They don't do anything. We got traffic agents having to stand all over the city. You know, there was a gridlock alert day, and now we got to spend all this extra money because people didn't listen. I guess none of these illegally parked vehicles got the message that it was a gridlock alert day. Look at this. Get on the bus! Get out of your car! Yay! Well, look at this! It seems that I have found some evidence of gridlock alert day working. I mean, look at this street. It's great. There's nobody driving. There's people riding bikes. There's people walking around. Well, look at that. It has nothing to do with the gridlock alert day. It's just because it's a open street. It has a shared five mile an hour zone here for sharing the road with everybody here. Okay. The cacophony of sound is deafening, of course. I mean the triple A. Hey, how about like the triple C? Cycling, conquers, congestion. Or the triple T, transit, triumphs over tin cans. Yes, hello everybody, getting off the bus, oh yes. How are you supposed to cross? There's no way to cross here. That's because no one listened to gridlock alert day. Okay, okay, I'm so excited. I'm about to go over the Brooklyn Bridge. Brand new bike path for the first time. Ooh, this is one of those sweet e-bikes. Thanks for the rental, Street Films. Okay, this the handlebars look like they're working. Let's test the bell. Okay, let's go. Well, I got a word for you, Mr. CBS2 reporter. Remember you were out here interviewing drivers about uh, congestion and gridlock alert week? Remember that? Well, the concrete barriers have been on this path here for like over three months. So how did the bike path just suddenly cause congestion? You gotta get smarter, you people. Don't come around here no more. That might be better just singing that instead of gridlock alert days. 